Six million more train journeys each year, delivering a £650 million boost to the region's economy. That's according to a report unveiled today by the transport body Midlands Connect. It's recommending a variety of measures aimed at increasing the frequency of trains and reducing journey times while helping to get more freight off the roads and onto the railways. Here's our transport correspondent, Peter Plisner. Overcrowding. Every single day overcrowding. It's just not on time. The delays, cancellations, getting back home is a nightmare. Passengers for the delay day 25 to I service to London Marmot. More carriages, more seats, better signalling. There's delays all the time. The passengers' view of what's needed to make the railways better, and it's clear there's plenty that needs doing. Today we got part of the answer, a new 20-year strategy, not just designed to help the railways, but according to one of its authors, the whole regional economy. There's a big prize out there, but it will only come if we have the right building blocks in place, and clearly connectivity is one of those key building blocks. We need to make some changes. The new strategy suggests a series of interventions designed to maximise capacity across the Midlands network, helping to increase the number of trains on key routes. Journey times would get shorter too. Hereford to Birmingham would come down from 84 minutes to just 60. Birmingham to Nottingham down 19 minutes to 50 minutes. And a new direct service from Coventry to Leicester taking just 35 minutes. Long distance journeys to Cardiff, Bristol and Derby would also get quicker. But it's not just about passengers on the railways. This report also talks about significant increases in freight capacity. Authors suggest they can find space for around 36 additional freight trains every day, bringing around 4,000 of these lorries off the roads. Midlands Connect is looking at things from all angles, from multimodally, so as well as looking at uh, how we can improve passenger services, we've also got to think about how we're going to improve uh, the likes of uh, car drivers, and one of the ways to do that is to get lorries off the roads. It's a 20-year strategy that's not yet funded, so don't expect the changes to happen overnight. Peter Plisner, BBC Midlands Today. An inquest speech.